friend. It's so good to see you here. Hi, this is Nilsi. Welcome to our Meet with Blessing. So uh, first I want to thank Clarendon UMC for the lovely service that we had last Sunday. If you haven't watched it yet, please uh, look for July 4th worship service right here on our channel. Uh, it was so beautiful. Thank you so much for ev to everybody who was present either there or in thought. I appreciate all of the messages, the cards. Thank you so much for a great welcome. I'm so happy to be here. So if you were here this past Sunday, if you watched our service, you will know that you had some homework. You had a homework to do. We talked about heavenly treasure and what that means and how do we go about collecting heavenly treasures for our treasure box. So your homework was to look through Matthew 5, 6, and 7 and use a highlighter and highlight or write down um, all of the ways that we can collect heavenly treasures according to Jesus. So Matthew 5, 6, and 7 is where you find the Sermon of the Mount. And those three chapters are specifically teachings from Jesus. And one of those teachings is how to get, um, collect heavenly treasures. So how are you doing with your homework? Have you started yet? You can do one chapter a day. You can do it all at once. But you're pretty much looking for um, verses that specifically give reward uh, where Jesus said if you do this then you receive a reward in heaven uh, so I want today I want to share with you one of the treasures that can be found in chapter 7 verse 11 it says that our God gives good things to those who ask you know a lot of times uh, we might go the whole day without praying to God or we pray during the meals but it's so refreshing just to take some time to talk to God. It doesn't have to be formal. You don't have to look for a prayer book in particular, but you can share what's in your heart. And you know, sometimes we have to even ask the Holy Spirit for the desire to do things, for the desire to read God's word, for the desire to pray, because you know, life can be quite busy and we are, uh, going through a time of change, a time we have never experienced before. So isn't it comforting to know that we can go to God and ask for anything. Come to God with our doubts, come to God with um, our hardships, with questions, with anything. I love knowing that we can even go to God and ask for the desire to do the right things, the desire to go after heavenly treasures, or the desire to do God's will. So I want to encourage you this week to find heavenly treasures and to ask God for anything that you need. I hope you have a great rest of your week. We love you and we see you this Sunday. Bye-bye.